Good evening. My name is Kathleen. People call me Kathy Schaff. My husband and I have lived in Erie all our lives. We have two daughters who are adults who live in Florida. I presently am running for Erie City Council. I am an accountable, community, engaged, active listener and previous vice president of Erie City Council in the past. I was a financial advisor, a chairperson for two years, and this past year, even though I was not on council, I attended as many council meetings as I could, along with study sessions and watched many departmental meetings. My community involvement is being a part of the Summer of Hope. I walked in the East Bayfront neighborhood talking with residents as they did their survey. I went with Aaron Carey and worked on property condition surveys, which helped our planning department in the Trinity neighborhood and Central Erie off of Parade. I volunteered in the Academy Marvintown area with surveys and discussions at doorsteps, as well as volunteered and walked with the Strengthening Police Partnership volunteers, walking along 7th and 8th Street near Wallace and Parade, giving out assistance flyers to those who opened their door to talk. I also have volunteered in the community with neighborhood groups that have cleaned up and have been a part of the Our West Bayfront neighborhood, volunteering actively at their Gridley Park location and have enjoyed passing out treats at Halloween and serving Thanksgiving dinners. During the pandemic, I passed out COVID safety packets sponsored by the community centers with volunteers and policies in the 16504 area around 26th and Parade. I assisted bipartisan voter registration times at Perry Square and at the Blasco Library. I've attended Girl Scout and Boy Scout events. I was a regular at COG meetings for two years, as well as attending the Mayor's Disability Roundtable pre-COVID. Chris Groner would brief me regularly on the economic development plans in the works with possible future endeavors. Growth is certainly needed and necessary for sustainability here. Liz Allen and I attended the Municipal League training in Harrisburg. We went to workshops on the budget, the land bank, EMS county safety, tourism, and histories of banking in Erie. We attended lectures at Gannon, Mercyhurst, Erie Insurance, the Jefferson Society, and public schools. Homeless issues are close to my heart. I've been at the forefront of downtown city issues, advocating for drinking fountains, restroom facilities, and advocating for a resting area for the homeless. I don't look at city hall departments as a negative, but as a stepping stone. I have learned so much being on council previously to know that I cannot promise you anything 
because it takes time. So many things take time and we have to work together as a community to have the patience for change. I would love for you to consider me as a community advocate for yourself. For that is one thing that I have that is perhaps unique to any other candidate. I take the time to invest in people. I am a people person. I think that a community leader should be active in the community. I have gone to vigils for people who have been gunned down. I have been at funerals for the firefighter who passed away, police officer who have passed away, for the children who died in a horrific fire. I commit myself to you, the community, to help in any way I can. I actively take phone calls and do the research that is needed to make critical decisions. I will meet with you at coffee shops or talk to you on the phone or meet with you right at City Hall if I am elected as a city council person. My father was a police officer. I grew up knowing that each and every day that he went out the door, that he may not come back a whole being. I do support the police and fire department for this reason. They are our first responders. They are the people who go out the door each and every day, committing themselves to serve as best as they are able. We have so many issues at the present moment here in our city. I am also willing to work with the Erie School District and the Erie County Council as much as I am able to. I believe that as we work together, we become a team and there is no I in team. I will not take credit when we work together as a team for the best that we can be in our community. We need to get the guns off the streets. We need to get the drugs off the streets. We need people to care about where they live. We need housing to become more affordable. So many times I have talked with homeless people who have lost their homes. I have also helped them by giving them furniture. I oftentimes buy things drastically reduced at garage sales and have stored them in my home only to give back for them when it is needed. So once again, I believe that our entire community from young to old needs to work together to help our city be a better place. And I would hope to be your voice. I am number two on the ballot for the four-year term, and I am also on the ballot for the one-year term. You can actually vote for me under the four-year and the two-year position that is open. I thankfully am delighted to be presenting today due to Kim. Thank you. Thank you again. And please vote, if you are able to, Kathleen Kathy Schaff on May 16th.
Thank you.